Hello, my name is Arona Khan. If, like me, you enjoy being creative and crafty, how about making jigsaw puzzles while repurposing or upcycling things around your home, like empty packaging, pages from magazines, greeting cards, or even offcuts of wrapping paper that often end up in the recycling bin? As well as empty boxes and sheets of card, you will need your preferred cutting tools, some PVA glue, and perhaps a metal ruler. For my first attempt, I used a scrap of card and a page from a magazine. Having spread the glue all over the cardboard, I stuck it to the picture and then trimmed off the excess paper. When the glue was dry, I got busy with my pinking shears. Top tip time. Do make sure that you take a photograph of the picture before you cut it up. A lightweight jigsaw like this one may require little bits of sticky tape on the back to hold them in place. Now let me show you how I upcycled a greeting card. First I put it on a cutting mat because I was using a rotary cutter. I'd also do that if I was using a craft knife. This time I'm just using the front of the card but you could also stick the front and back together to make it thicker. As you can tell, I'm rather keen on cutting my card into triangles. Time for another top tip. I find it really useful to use a self-adhesive memo board like this one when I'm putting my jigsaw puzzles together. Alternatively, using pinking shears or craft scissors, perhaps with a scalloped edge, makes it easier to secure the pieces in place. As well as using pages from a magazine like this great advertisement, you could use offcuts of wrapping paper to great effect. Or how about taking some cardboard packaging and making a picture on the inside so that it becomes a double-sided jigsaw? That's exactly what I've done with this cereal packaging by using both the front and the back. As you can see, I've also used scissors and pinking shears. For my final top tips, a stack of books can come in really handy if you need to flatten a few pieces of the jigsaw. And if yours has straight sides, try making it up on the inside of a box lid as it helps to hold all the pieces in place.